we have also the applet and the app ID of the mini program or official account or app before the jump with this refer info app ID field. Then we have referring for extra data to get data from the app before the jump only supported by once these things. Yeah, um, we have several as refer enforce extra data. Referring for app ID can only be returned in some things like given here. The same values that support the return of referring for app ID are shown in this table. We have the scene to of the list of related mini programs on the profile page of the, the official account to return the source official account app ID, the official account customer, customer new to return to source official account app ID, app share message card to return to source application app card ID, mini program, open mini program to return the source applet ID, return from another applet official account template message to return source official account app ID, these things. What's more, uh, this function can also support adding custom global variables. The name, value, and number of global variables can be customized by the developer. You see here, if we set it here, it means it is a global variable. When the page that needs to be opened does not exist, then we have a native template page to prompt. If the developer does not want to jump to this page, we can handle it by ourselves. We need to use on page not found listener. And in, yeah, this method has three attributes. Pies query is entry page with their value type string, object, and boolean. For pass is the pass to the page does not exist. Query to open a page that does not exist and is entry page to see whether it's the first page launched this time. For example, coming from an entry such as sharing, the first page is the sharing page configured by the developer. Yeah, you see the code here on the right can replace the native template page with the specified page. It should be noted that if the on page function, on page not found function callback is, in, is redirected to another page that does not exist, it will be redirected to the native play templates page that com comes with the WeChat to prompt that the page does not exist. And the on page not found monitoring effect will no longer be triggered. I, 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 I. Yeah. You see in this code, we have this function and we redirect to this page. This, um, this is another page. Oh yeah, this redirect to is our method to navigate to another page. Then we have this function get app. We can use it to get the, the applet instance in other JS files of the applet. At this point, we can get the public data saving here on the test. Uh, JS page and print it out in the console. It is. That's what we want to know here. That's what it says here. We have the 
global data use uh, we have set it as our global variable and then in other pages we can use it Yeah, it should be noted that we cannot call get a function inside a function. We can directly use the keyword this in mm, this one. We can directly use it. Yeah. The applet uses the page function in each page just there to register the page. This function can be used to specify the life cycle function of the applet page. We should pay attention that the page function can already be written in JS file corresponding to each page of the applet and each page can only register one. You see here the applet uses the page function in each page just fail to register the page. This function can be used to specify the life cycle function of the applet page. And this function can already be written in the JS file corresponding to each page of the applet. And each page can already register one. In addition to pay functions, page also supports adding custom page variables, the name, value, and the quantity of variables here can also be customized by the developer. We have the initial data. The first item generated by default in the page function is the data attribute, which is the initial data used for the first rendering of the page. When the page is loaded, data will be passed from the logic layer to the rendering layer in the form of JSON strings. So the data in data must be of a type that can be converted into JSON, like string, number, boolean, object, array. And then the rendering layer can bind data through WXML. You see here we have an example. We can put two custom data in this one. We have message. They will need not display the eternal content, but we'll find the initial data in the data and then display the word. Yeah, okay, we can try. Mm, you see, we have our platform here. Mm, we all it yeah you see um we use our demo yeah as we say we put them in page data we can set two pieces of data like given by the example we set message one we set it as uh, hello. Then message two. We set it as uh, yeah. We are two thousand twenty-one now. Then here in the logic layer, we have already defined these two data. We need to show you see we compare, but. It isn't shown here in demo. Yeah, you see in demo, it showed nothing. Okay, perhaps it's, you see in demo, it showed nothing. It's better that I ask it to compare directly at demo. It's better that I change the color of this. What do you think of it? It's, it's fine, Laoshi. 
It's fine like this? Yes, that was true. Okay, thank you, um, Kaya. Yeah, you see here, we have already defined these two data. I have compared, you see, I have compared. Oh, just what I, just what I have done is here. Um, normally it's ordinary compilation. Then you can add compilation mode to show which page at first. I have shown this page at first. What that's what I have done here. And from here, what each time I do, I do the compilation. It will show this at first. Yeah, here we have defined these two data, but it is not sure. We have to show it by this file how to show it we can call it for example view we use the component view yeah um we ask it to now we ask it to display these two data how to yeah you see we recompare and you see here it is shown hello 2021 yeah that's why we say that the data we defined in this data will be considered as our, yeah as variables used in other pages Yeah, in this example, it's similar. Then we have the life cycle callback function. As we have seen before, we have the onload, on shore, on ready, on high down, on unload. They are generated by default in the page function, and they all belong to the life cycle callback function of the page. We have some explanations of this function. On load, it is only triggered once when the page is loaded and the parameters attached to the path to open the current page can be obtained in the, in the on load parameters. On sure, it is triggered when the page is displayed or switched from the background of the applet to the foreground. On redditch, it is triggered when the first rendering of the page is complete. A page can only be called once, which means the applet is ready to interact with the viewer, view layer. On hide it, it's triggered when the applet is hidden or cut into the background, for example, navigate to, or the button tab switches to another page and the applet switches to the background. On unload, it's, to, it's triggered when the page is unloaded, such as redirect to or navigate back to other pages. Yeah. Mm, here, we say that we have several functions, several elements that are generated by default in this function. We have pull down, on pull down, refresh, on reach button, on share apps message. On page scroll and on tab item type, they are not automatically generated belong to the event processing functions of the page. We have some explanations like here. On pull down, Refresh is to monitor user product refresh events on reach button to monitor the buttoning, the buttoning event of the user's pull down on page scroll to monitor user sliding page events. Yeah, we will see. Um, yeah, we will see this function in detail with uh, with our examples. Yeah, you can have a break of 10 minutes and after the break, we'll continue and we're explaining with the um, examples. We'll explain these, these things.
If I didn't make mistake, Shibli, Faso, Saddam, I'm not here. Yes, Laoshi. Okay, thank you, Saji.
Okay, we have Pike. Mm. Shibli, Faso on here. Saddam. No, no, she, oh. they are not here. Okay, thank you, Fosan. Thank you. Um, Saddam, I see your assignment. That means you, you, um, it works. Now your program? Yes, Laoshi. Uh, it's work. work. Yeah, it, what was the problem? I think uh, uh, when I clear my uh, um, previous data or clear catch file, then it's work. Then could you repeat again? When I clear my uh, previous data, or, you know, when I uh, delete my uh, previous project and uh, uh, do it again. Okay. Then so it that works. means you have changed something else. Yes. Okay. Um. Yeah, uh, so it's okay. I, as I saw your... I see our assignment and I think it works with your program now. It's a, it's good. All right. We'll continue. Okay. Uh, I have one question. Yeah. How can I how can I upload uh, a picture? Upload a picture? Yes. Uh, uh, can we you are... please show me? Yeah. How uh, can uh, I upload? Uh, yeah, we can we can uh, you all see it later. In our, I think, in the fourth. No, no, no. Uh, uh, I talk about icon bar. You uh, don't have an icon bar? Yeah. Uh, my name, uh, means a uh, page icon, which you show us previous classes. Did you remember? You talk about my program. I'm sorry, not here. You say that here. Here, uh, yes, this uh, picture, home page picture, icon Lashi, picture. Talk I talk about, about this icon, home page icon, login icon, demos icon. You talk about these things. I yes, have yes, put I have put them here in our uh, in our How? file. How? Can you please oh, show me? You can. Uh, you find. You see here. Um, for example, either on uh, file you can find it. Open. Yeah, you can. Uh, normally, uh, reveal, reveal in file explorer. Okay. Then you can find the the pathway. Yeah, the path. Here is page. What I have done is I have created a file here to put my image, all my images. Uh, how can you uh, create this image file? It's just like this. You create a new file. Okay. You, you put simply. your... Yeah, it's simple. It's simply like this, and you okay. put your image here. Then it will appear here. It will appear oh, here. Okay. Yeah, like, oh, okay. I'll do a. Oh, I'm sorry. Here, um, for example, if I create a file called a fig figure, and I put some, you see, if I put this one. Okay, I put just the one to show you. Um, yeah, I put it here. 
Then in our program here, you see it is already shown here, figure. What we have okay. created just then, it is shown okay, here. Okay, Loshi, now I am clear. Yeah, okay. It's it's easy. Yes, it's easy. Yeah. Uh, I have I have I have one another question, Laoshi. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I I don't understand your uh, second assignment question. Can you please uh, explain it? How can I do? Yeah, second assignment. What what I do? For the second assignment, I have asked you to take pictures of three type bars page with at least two different navigation bar background color. Mm, it's, yeah, it, it's just uh, here. You see here we have one page, mm -hmm. here second page, here mm -hmm. third page, yeah? You see yeah. our first page here and third one, they share the same background page, uh, color. But the second yeah. one, it's different background color. That's all. Okay. Yeah, it is also simple. It's just, uh, we just need to change here. In the JSON file, you add, um, you change the, the text, the title, the background mm -hmm. color is so it's 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 not difficult. As um, if we want to change it, yeah. Um, okay. We can copy it. In the mouse, you see. For the moment, oh, I'm sorry. You see, for the moment, the mouse it has same color as the home page as because we have defined them. In app JSON, app JSON is a global setting. If we change yeah. it in demos, it will change this local setting. For example, um, here for demos, I change the title for um, here are our super examples. And then I change the color, mm, for example, FF00, zero, zero, um, 53. We'll see which color it corresponds. Yeah, you see, it changed this color. Yeah. Have you seen here, um, this one has changed too. Here are mm -hmm. our stupid examples. Okay, Laoshi. Yeah. yeah. You see it? Now I'm clear. Thank you. You are welcome. Okay. Um, Laoshi. Yeah, Sanji. Uh, how to write something inside the page like hello 2021? Um, you mean this one? No, Laoshi. Uh, so write something in the home page or login page. Here, you want to add something here? Yes, Laoshi, uh, this one, hello 2021. Oh, you, uh, for example, if we change this hello world, uh, if we yes, want to Lushi. change it, okay, it's here, home page, you find its page, uh, its index, and you find this file, you see here, we have this, um, yeah, we have already get something here. You can, container user information, information. Yeah, you can close it to create your own. For example, you can create view, as you say, mm, yeah. Or simply you can just write it here. Very simple, okay. To, Create difference between this one. We add or hello, twenty twenty one, and oh, we compare. It will come to this page, but it doesn't matter. We'll come here. Yeah, you see, it's here. 
Yes, Lao Shi. You so you um does it answer to your question? Yes, Lao Shi, you got it. Okay. Okay, Lao Shi. Okay. Uh, can I change the background color? Put background color. I'm sorry, Sada. Uh, can I change the page background color? You want to change the color of this part? Yes. How? Um, this part, it is not a turtle. It is composed. Um, it is composed by different components. We will mm. see them later. You okay. um yeah, it's not a a. a a single page like this, we can add a um, box or something here, okay? Okay, Um, If no other questions, we will continue? No question, Lucy. Okay, continue. thank you, Satam and Sashi. Here, Lushi. we have, we work here to show different page event, event tenders. Yeah, here we all see these. Mm -hmm. um, we have exactly three functions. We have on share app message function to monitor. It is to monitor the behavior of the user clicking the forward button. It is, yeah, It um, we use the button component. Its attribute value is like this, or the forward button in the upper right corner menu. And we can customize the forwarding content. Here we have the continue, um, yeah, continue. Um, you see, we have different parameters like from target web view URL, uh, the, their type string, object string, source of forwarding event button, forwarding button in the page menu, forwarding menu in the upper right corner. It um, If the from value is button, the target is the button that is that triggered this forwarding event, otherwise it is undefined. When the page contains the web view component, return the URL of the current web page view. We have also, yeah, this on share app message event needs to return an object object for custom forwarding content. The returned content is shown here. We have the title, forward title, the default is the current applet name path forwarding path. The default is the current page path. It must be a four path starting with the root directory image URL, the custom picture pies can be a local pay, file pies, a core package file pies or a network picture pies supports PNG or and JPG. The, sub, the aspect ratio of the displayed picture is um, here use the default screen in the minimal version. Um, we have the explanations of this field here. Now we have an example. <clears throat> using the on share app message. Yeah. yeah. Okay, we'll see it. Mm. Yeah, we can we can see it. It's yeah, it in fact it's it's here. Share. Uh, we can share it to somebody. You see it's here. It's this function, share. And uh, what we are do here console, um, yeah, you can see this, our example here, I'm sorry. In this example, we have this event. When it is triggered, we are, return the information of the forward bu button on the page console. Yeah, we will see 
we are trying this example. Okay, I'll copy it directly. Mm -mm -mm. It's here. I'll copy it. No, not this one. Mm. Yeah, this one we have already seen it. This one, it should be this one, yeah. Okay, I cannot copy it from here now. I can. I need to exist, exit to copy it. Yeah, you see, I or gated here page. I'll put it here on share at message. You see in the page, as we say, we have data, this function, then on load function, on ready function, on share, oh, sorry, on hide, on unload, on pull down refresh, on reach button, on share, yeah, here we will do it here. On share at message, um, we can put it here. Yeah, we can just replace it. Perhaps it's better. Oh, sorry. You see, wow, we have some problems because this one, we don't need this, it is already Okay, normally it's okay. Yeah, you see it's here. When we click this to forward something, somebody click, you see it is down and here normally we get some message Oh, it's too slow. We have this on share. Just um, forwarding. Header information of the forward button on the page in custom forwarding page path. Normally, will it will be shown here console log. Later. It doesn't show here. Uh, normally, it's because I have used a test code, test a tester, tester IP ID. Change. And normally it will show the, okay, I will ask it to do it directly. Oh, but that, but uh, perhaps we need to do this, but if we don't get real function, if we don't get it, you don't get a uh, 
Yeah, you see here we need to, so normally it has, it has done it. Okay. Oh, rest target is here. Says I have to tell the information. For example, if we console, um, if we ask her, ask it to put out something like, yeah, like this, what will happen? No information. Okay, we ask us it, uh, that means, oh, okay, the here you see, we are return with this page, but this page we did, uh, we can change it, change this page, for example, we are return to page, Um, index, index. Okay, we'll see it now. Do nothing. Will not come here. Normally, it should come here. Drop some DLT. Can you see normally this one? It's to when we forward somebody else, it will shown here. Send to friends. And then it will return back home page. What I have done here is like this. Exchange. We will see another. Here, this is on share app message, and we have on tab item tab. Here, it is triggered when we click on the tab. It is supported from this library, and we have it's called like this. We have the component event handler. It can. Define the component event processing function, add event binding to the component of the Weixin ML page. When the event is triggered, it will actively execute the corresponding event processing function in page. Yeah, okay, we are trying this one. You see, for example, type is our click event. We and we can use the this bind tab property to bind on the component. We are take uh yeah, we can take an example of the button tab. Button. We'll bind a click event to it. For example, here. Okay. We'll find a, uh, an event to this. Uh, yeah. For example, the same thing. We'll go to Weixin ML. This one. Um, 
we'll do we'll create a button button uh we'll bind my bind tab with the uh, yeah we may call it how can we call it mm, tap then we ask uh, what is shown here is we are clicking here okay and then we need to define this tab in js file we'll define it here We have called it type. We create a function. Oh yeah, pay attention. Uh, we need to add regular here to separate different functions. Then uh, we ask it to print out The button is clicked. Okay, we ask it, you see, now with this code, we can create a button here. Yeah, you see, we are clicking here, this button. And if we click it, we are trigger this event. Yeah, we are clicking here. And then you see here, it's shown the button is clicked. You see the, the event, how it is handled? Hello, Shay. Yes, Adam. Uh, can you please show me again if I create a button, what I need to do? Uh, it concerns two pages. Here, in the page JS, you need to create a function. A function to define the event, how to handle the event when it is triggered. Yeah, you see, I have named the function as tap. You can name it um, differently. Then, uh, yeah, the format is like this the syntax um, the function name function then formal parameters later in the body i ask it to print out the button is clicked in this um, console you see if i click it again it will write another one yeah you see here two times it is written two here have you seen it two if i yes, click it Okay, thank you. If I click again, three. Here is about how it is handled this event. And in waiting ML here, we just need to create create it here. So we have used button this component. In this component, you see the, the structure is like this here. For each component is like this. Then in the body, I have said that I need to add this bind this button to the function, bind type to this function to type. Then here is what we will show in the middle of the button. Okay, is it clear? Yes, Logic. Can you please show me your uh, demo dot? js file again yeah the js file is here oh, okay okay Loshi. now i'm clear okay so here we have um, seen our click Page. Oh, 
now we are see another uh, here is an event handler then we have also also root in the page function we can also use this root to view the path address of the current page yeah we can yeah we can see this we can it's it's simple too it's simple to test this one too um, it's in onshore function onshore function it's here onshore function we use um console log um then we ask it to print the root of it you see when we click yeah you see here when this page is appeared directly the page is shown here then we click here we show this one if we um change it to another page for example rocking uh, it is shown this one and we come back here you see we come back here this page is shown again have you seen it here this um, okay i will see oh sorry okay we are try again um uh, here we have login then we come back to yeah the warning um here the warning is about the clear we come back to our demos okay it's, it's not showing here we we'll use a message yeah it's here then we come to we click it the button is clicked. Now, if we go back to this one and we come back here, this is shown again. Have you seen how the event is handled by onshore? Each time when we show this page, this event is handled. So the path is shown here. Is it clear? Yes, Laoshi. Okay, thank you, Saji. We have all sorts other functions like set data. We can use it to synchronously update the data value in the data attribute. It will also synchronously update the, the relevant data to waste ML page. Here we have two fields data callback. We have object function we can describe that for data one or more data to be updated. Then we can set data callback function after the rendering of the, the interface update is completed. Uh, we'll see this example to define the initial data. Um, we have, uh, yeah, we can set it. Yeah, we can set a data like this here. Okay, I will see. I will try this with you. Same thing. In this page, data will create a variable called today. Then we'll get it like, um, we can say it, it's, 2021, it's March 25th. Don't forget this one dot. Then we need to use it. Yeah, um, use it in waiting ML. For example, we get it. You. Mm. Oh yeah, the same thing. We can we can try go uh, like just then. We can again if we tap it, we'll change data. Oh yeah, we'll change we'll change date. 
Okay. Mm. Then what is shown here is the variable we have created today. Okay, we will come back to JS file to create change date. Okay, we can create it directly here. Um, change date. We have used the big function. What's wrong? Um, in a function, what we do is to set um set the variable today. Okay. Oh. Um. Okay. Here I will change it to today, but here, uh, we can say it. Okay. We will put it like this to see the difference. Okay. We compare it. You see, firstly. It is not shown. There, oh, there is an error. On load. Okay, this um. Just as I said, don't forget to add the dot behind a function or behind a variable if it is followed by other data or other variable, uh, other functions, okay? Now, it, yeah, you see it is shown here. You, it's the, the initial value of today. If we click it, you see, now we click it, it is changed to this value, yeah? Have you seen it? Uh, Laoshi, can you please uh, on your debugger and show me the code? You see here, uh oh, sorry. What I have done here is just, I'll put it down to see much more. Here, what I have done, firstly, I have created a variable today. I have initialized it at 2001, March 5th. Then I have set a function to change the value of today. When we want to change the value of our variable, we need to use the method set data. We have set the set the variable data um, today, the variable today with this value, this new value. Then how I'll show it, what I have done is here. At first, just this one, you see, just this, um, at first it is shown this, it is a component view to show the variable today. And then when I add this one, that means if I click it, I will trigger the event, change data and change date. Okay, like the here, if we click here, we are event, we are trigger the event type. Is it all right? Yes, Laoshi. We can also modify something like, um, yeah, here, change date. Here we can also ask it to, uh, like before, ask it to, um, to print out something. Oh, I'm sorry. Log, um, for example, what we are be printed here, we can ask it to print something like 
the date is changed. Yeah, we ask it to do this thing and you will see. Yeah. You see here. Mm, we have arrived at this page. As we say, click it, the button is clicked. Then this one, when we click it, as before, it is changed. And here, the data is changed. We click it again. Another time, the data is, cha the data is changed. The button is clicked. And another time, the data is changed. Is it clear? You, you have seen the effect? Yes, Laoshi. OK, thank you. And this will be the assignment of today. Uh, to realize. Laoshi, uh, what we will do in demo.wxml file? I'm sorry? Uh, so when we click, the date will be sent. So what we will do in demo.wxml file? Oh. Um, how this file is created, is that what you ask? Yes, Laoshi. It is generated automatically. Uh, when you add, you, you, normally it's it's already there. Uh, Saji, I think you have already sent your assignment to me, yeah? Yes, Laoshi. Yeah, you see, um, normally it's there. Uh, you see, you have already created a, a, a file um, index logs profile, yeah? You have, um, yeah, you have created a profile, your page. Yes. There, prof your profile is like my, um, my demo, so, in the profile uh, file, you see profile JS and profile Weixin ML. Have you seen it? Uh, yes, Laoshi. Yeah, so it is generated automatically. When you uh, add page there, it will be generated. When you add pages here, Pages, yeah. When you add pages here, it will be, for example, um, yes. Uh, if we create another page, pages, uh, we say it my page, like you say, profile, profile, yeah. Hmm. We compare, we compare it. You see here in this. Our page fell. Have you seen it? Yes, my Moshe. page is already created. It is our. Uh, uh, that's mean create a new page and uh, new file profile dot js profile dot json like this. Yeah, you see it. They are already here. Uh, okay, Lashi, got it. Okay, thank you. Uh, so have you heard my? Um, question here is to to realize a button and a date. Okay, I'll publish it directly. Okay, Laoshi. Yeah, if you have listened to. Understood, Laoshi. Okay, thank you. Please realize. The date function. Take screenshots. Screenshots. The cut uh, of console and and interface. Okay. We have publish. I will publish it. Um. Any questions? 
Are there any questions? No, no question. She, no yeah? question. She. I'm curious. I've noticed that you record our lectures. So do you publish them on the Superstar app as well? I'm sorry, Kaya. Um, I've noticed that I've noticed that you record our lectures. So do you publish them on the Superstar app as well? The chat yeah. app. Yeah, I have published the assignments in uh Chaoxing platform. Not the assignments, Laoshi. I mean the lectures. Lectures you're yeah. recording. It says that the recording file will be sent to Shu Qing via the message center. So that means you're recording, your cloud recording, I think. This, you mean this one? Okay, I will send, um, I will send the link. I, yeah, I normally I can find the link. Okay, I send it there. Oh, I, I put it in WeChat. No, I'm sorry. I put it in Chaoxing platform, okay? The link, okay, yes. Okay. Thank you. The link, yeah, it will uh, have a link. Mm. Okay, Lakshi, if, if I am able to download the link, do you mind if I upload them to YouTube for the students who are in the country to watch? Uh, if you want, it's okay too. Oh, okay. Yeah, if others cannot, um, cannot, um, yeah, cannot follow the class via Chaoxin platform, you, yeah, you can put it on YouTube or other, uh, yeah, or other platform if it's convenient for others. Okay, Lashi, I will do that. Okay. Any other questions? No, no, sure. Thank you. Okay, thank you. If not, we are stop here. Um, yeah, so have a good time and see you next week. Have a good weekend. Bye, Laoshi. Thank you. Bye-bye. Take care. Thank you, you too.